Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover how to calculate percent change. And specifically, we're going to take a look at an example of a percent decrease. Let's jump into our example where we have an original value of 45 and then a new value of 36. We had a change. The original value, 45, decreased, decreased to 36. So we need to figure out the percent change we have here. Now to calculate percent change, we can take the new value and subtract the original value. That gives us the amount of change, the amount of increase or decrease. Then we divide that result by the original value. And keep in mind, always divide by the original value because we are finding the percent change from that original value. That's going to give us a decimal. We then multiply that decimal by 100 to convert it to a percent. So here, in order to calculate the percent change, we have percent change equals, and we take the new value, 36, subtract the original value, 45, divide by the original value, 45, and then multiply by 100. Let's work through this now. 36 minus 45 gives us negative 9. And that negative tells us we have a decrease here. If we end up with a positive, that tells us we have an increase. So we have negative 9 over 45 times 100. So we have that change of negative 9. We decreased by 9 over the original value of 45. Now we need to divide. So we have negative 9 divided by 45. That gives us negative 2 tenths. So now we have negative 2 tenths times 100. So we're taking that decimal and multiplying it by 100 in order to convert it to a percent. And a quick way to multiply by 100 is to move the decimal twice to the right. So once, twice to the right, and we can fill this gap, this place, with a zero. And that gives us negative 20%. Now that negative tells us we have a decrease. So we went down 20%. So this was a 20% decrease. So there you have it. There's an example of calculating a percent change. And specifically, we looked at a percent decrease. Check the description for a percent increase example. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.